The Nets and the NBA are going to make this man apologize for what he did. And late last night, that's exactly what happened. Kyrie apologized. Look, you could see the handwriting on the wall of what was going to happen. I mean, the Nets were going to keep him out until he apologized. And again, I'm not going into whether it's right or wrong or what you think he should have done. That's not what this is about. I'm just talking about what the Nets were absolutely going to do. They were not going to let him step back on that basketball court until he apologized. And what I believe the next step was coming is that his representatives were going to go to the Nets and say, look, we're dug in here. We're not apologizing. We want to be bought out. And the Nets were, were going to say, yeah, you can be bought out, but we're going to give you pennies on the dollar to be bought out. I'm assuming that probably didn't sit right with Kyrie, you know, losing all this money, not to go on top of all the money that he lost last year. So the guy came out and just caved and just apologized. Even still, I'm still not sure that the Nets are going to put him back on the court, man. There's a lot of damage that's been done, you know, with this whole thing. I'm still not sure that the Nets are still not going to just either waive him, uh, buy him out, whatever the case may be. I'm still not positive that that won't happen. And if that does happen and he gets bought out, that's going to be bad news for Kyrie because I really only see two teams that are desperate enough for talent that would even touch Kyrie right now, and that would be the Mavericks and the Lakers. And even then, that's a stretch for both of those, but I think those two are on the cusp of having something. You just need another infusion of talent, and Ty Kyrie is extremely talented and will help both of those ball clubs. I just don't know that other NBA teams are going to step up to that plate right now. Now, look, again, I'm not getting into whether it's right or wrong or whatever you believe that he did. That's not what I'm talking about here, man. I, I don't want to get into that political game because you can't win. I just believe that Kyrie did what he needed to do to save his job, what a lot of us would do to save their job, man. I, I don't believe that he's really sorry, and he doesn't have to be sorry. But I think he did what he needed to do to save his job, possibly save him a ton of money. Uh, I mean, it is what it is at this point, man. Let me know what you guys think.